Adore Marie, and today I will. Hey guys, it's Adore Marie, and today I will be doing a get ready with me chit chat. I don't know. Um, by the way, I love my nails. Look how pretty they are. They're blue by OPI. I'm just getting ready for a party, so. So anyways, I'm going to start off with moisturizing my face. This is my lazy day, everyday makeup. So if you are looking, you want to get ready with me, then you could. So I'm just moisturizing my face. I wash. I took a shower and I... We had to pick up stuff for a party and now I am just getting ready. I don't even know what I'm saying. But anyways... Episode 13, Season 4 of Orange is New Black. I'm like, I almost teared up last night. I don't know if it's because I sleep late now. And when you sleep late, you like get kind of emotional and you're like, but that happened. And I'm going to put on this BB cream, it's my favorite, by Maybelline. Yeah, I'm on episode 13 and I'm not going to say anything about the show because I want you guys to know. I like, I'm halfway through and I go on Twitter and I saw this scene. I saw something that I did not want to see, so I advise you not to go on Twitter if you watch Orange the New Black because it will ruin it for you, like, a lot. So don't do that because it will ruin it for you. Um, sorry, I keep looking at the viewfinder, but I have a mirror down here. It's just a random mirror. I don't know where my mom got it, but it really works. It's nice and clear and, like, it's really helpful. It's not that heavy. It's not like those heavyweight ones where it has lights up, even though those are really, really cool. But work with what you got, you know? My face is really light. Just notice. Uh, but anyways, how's your day? I'm gonna be putting on this BB cream right here by Garnier. Oops. The only thing I don't like about this BB cream is the packaging because it's very leaky and very runny. So it is messy and as you could tell it's very orange or does it show up orange on here I have no idea but anyways that is my foundation and it has like an orange tone but it has really good coverage it's like really good other than Maybelline Maybelline's my first and then it goes towards Neutrogena and Garnier just cuz Neutrogena has some skin clearing products but they're kind of pricey so I don't really know how I feel about them make sure you blend well, I remember I used to use foundation. That was what it was. I used foundation and everyone complimented my face. Foundation was the Stay Matte Foundation by Rimmel. And that foundation is bomb. Except I haven't found my shade and I can't really purchase it. There's a lot of foundations that I like, but that was like the one that everyone complimented me for. If you know what I'm saying. But now I'm going to conceal. I know the drill. I use this concealer by LA Girl. And I found this at this one clothing store. I had to buy this all the way, like an hour away. This product is so good, but you have to go all the way, like an hour away to get it. Unless you want to order online. Um, yeah. Other than that, that's what's happening in my life at the moment. Just waiting for college. I haven't went anywhere yet. I just go to the mall and chill. Starbucks, Target, take it home because I don't like going out around the area, which is weird. So now I'm using this Garnier concealer. This thing lasts for so long and it burns my eyes. I don't know if it's expired or it's just like burning my eyes. This is in the shade medium, medium deep too. And it's like still light. It has a yellow undertone, which is perfect. Anyone could wear makeup, anyone. But um, with anyone who has yellow undertone like me, perfect. Cause, oh, it, like, I don't know, it just works. Undertone of yellow. Sorry, I'm not a makeup artist, so I don't know much about this. Um, I'm gonna do my brows now. Um, I use this product. You guys already know if you guys haven't seen my eyebrow routine. I use this. I'm not an eyebrow person, so I don't know much. Oh, gosh, this is so hard. Honest, eyebrows are kind of hard to work with. They're really hard to work with. Seriously, they are. Like, it never works. Is it even nice today? Let's see, look, they're kind of like weird. Are they kind of weird today? They're different. They're just really different. <sighs> Anyways, this is hard. This is hard to talk. 
and do your brows at the same time. Everyone probably knows that. Like at the beginning, it's hard. Uh, okay. This brow. Oof. Okay. Eyebrows are not sisters. Eyebrows are not sisters. Okay. So moving on. So the the brows are not the bomb at all. I'm sorry. I should probably like outline the ends of this. Okay, so moving on, I'm gonna conceal. Usually when you put on concealer, it should be lighter. Usually when you put on concealer, you make it lighter underneath so it can have a nice highlight. So I'm gonna use uh, this concealer. My favorite concealer brush, if I can find it. One is NYX. And I'm just gonna trace underneath the brow, like so. Usually, the top part is supposed to be the same shade as your skin tone, but I have no time for that. I'm, I've been slacking. Really slacking. Like, really. Okay. I cannot talk while doing this. Okay, whatever. Look at my nails are so pretty. The nail polish is so pretty. Okay. I tried. So, brows are not sisters. Moving on. Concealer, that's over with. We're gonna move on to the darker shade of the brow. I'm gonna be taking my chocolate bar palette to trace the ends. Make them last all night. Taking longer than I expected. Whatever, okay, moving on to face powder. I'm gonna be using the simple everyday Neutrogena face powder. I need to buy a new one. It's my favorite, I'm just say. I legit am running out, so. I just packed this onto my face because it has some properties that I really love, like acne fighting. So this is a life savior. It's a life saver, life savior. Yeah, and it's a good product if you have acne. So this will help you a lot. I really want to try the airspun and baking powders because, you know, everyone is doing it, but they don't sell it at Target. So that's a big no-no. Just FYI, Target, if you're listening or watching this video, my hair is really bad. Now I'm gonna do a little wash of shadow. Oh snap, I picked up the wrong thing. I take this NYX shadow in nude, and I'm taking this brush I got from Kate the Great. So I'm gonna be putting this all over the lids just to fight oiliness. Put it on there real quick. Cause I am really oily. Just like though. Okay, now moving on to, oh my gosh, my hair is so messed up. My eyebrows are not on fleek, I'm sorry. If you think it's easy, it's not. Okay, now I'm gonna contour a little using the uh, Lorac Pro palette, cause I have it, Lorac, Lorac palette. Got from Love Princess O. I'm taking light contour and trying to contour my face a little. So I'm just gonna dust that onto my wannabe cheekbones and bring back the color back to my skin okay then a little bit of medium contour just a little bit can act as a blush like so then oopsie we're gonna take something a little bit bronzy because this skin needs color so I'm gonna take this messed up Really, really messed up. Tarte Amazonian clay powder. And I'm just gonna dust this, like a lot. Just a lot of this because I need a new one. Onto my cheeks. It gives me a highlight, but color at the same time as you could tell. Just, just this. Dude, I need to straighten my hair. Okay, okay. I feel like there's something missing. Like something is just not right. Oh my nose. Needs a lot of help. Okay, then off you go by dusting off your whole face. Oh, I just noticed I did not do one thing, which I don't know where it's at. My face is really light. My lips need a little color, so I'm gonna be taking this Bite Lip Stick. I'm putting a little bit just so it could give me color. See, it's very sheer. Oh, well, cause I just put it a little bit. This could be dark or it could be light. It depends on how you put it. It's very moisturizing, by the way, so if you don't like putting on makeup, then 
I invite you to try that out. Now I need to strain my hair for a little highlight. I'm gonna be taking the Morphe palette 350 and I'm just gonna dust a little bit of shadow. Taking, hmm, which is a good highlighter? It's a good highlighter. There's a shade right here that's really nice. So I'm gonna put that on my under brow, my brow bone. Okay, that's enough. I'll be back. So I just strained my hair. Well, I tried to. Do you notice, Della? Yeah. It's kind of strained. Hey. And I will spray my face now. Bro, you take yourself off. Oh. So I'm going to be putting on this powder right just to dust, just to dust my face because it's like really, really red. So that is a very itchy brush. I'm going to spray my face so my face will be set for the night. The slick makeup setting spray. You guys already know the drill. Okay. Oh, that burns my eyes. And I think I am done with the face. So that's the lazy go-to makeup. Not really lazy. So if you guys have any other requests or any type of videos you guys want me to film, comment down below and I will talk to you guys later. Subscribe, like, rate, and peace out.